Ops Cymru is a three-year project and the aim of Ops Cymru is to reduce harm from postpartum hemorrhage across Wales. Um, we aim to do this through risk assessment, measuring blood loss at all births, um, rotum guided testing and also multidisciplinary team working. Probably about um, eight, nine, ten years ago we saw a, a, a big problem with postpartum hemorrhage. Women were having to go to intensive care, women were bleeding um, and it was very difficult with the knowledge that we had at the time, with the blood products we had at the time, to, to seem to change anything. We were getting complications and so um, I very much could see the clinical problem. We then worked with the maternity network and specifically in the quality and safety subgroup meeting and identified that postpartum hemorrhage was one in the top five leading causes of risk on every delivery suite throughout Wales. So this was a problem that really everybody wanted to look at and this is where the Ops Cymru project came from. In responding to a postpartum hemorrhage, it really is an emergency and it needs everybody to be working together in that situation. You need everybody from the porter who's bringing your blood products to the senior obstetrician who's potentially going to do life-saving procedures. You need everybody in the room to be working together with a common goal and I think this is a perfect example of that style of partnership working. You can only manage postpartum hemorrhage if on your delivery suite you've got midwives, obstetricians, and anaesthetists working together for an understanding what, what, what the process is. So midwives are going to be really key to the success of the OBS Cymru project. We have midwife champions in each health board and they're responsible for uh, collecting the data, making sure all blood loss is measured and also delivering um, teaching to midwives but also making sure that we engage a multidisciplinary team. Um, it's a very exciting project that will engage midwives all across Wales. Um, each of the seven health boards is involved. Six of those health boards have got obstetrician-led delivery suites and within each of those delivery suites is a champion team made up of a haematologist, an anaesthetist, an obstetrician and a midwife. And in particular those midwifery champions have been given seconded time to actually dedicate to the project. And as a project team we thought it was really important to have a patient involved. And so um, our representative um, was here today talking about her story and the issues that she feels quite passionate about. And so we've kind of fed that back into our project and that's going to be a, a big future development about looking at how we can support patients in recovering from their first hemorrhage. Taking the project forward then we're going to build on the established collaboration that we've already got between A Thousand Lives, the Health Boards, Maternity Network Wales, the Welsh Government, Rotem and many other people that we're already linking in with to really build on the collaboration that we have got and work together to make uh, the care of our women in Wales significantly better. As well as clinical leadership fellows, um, this day is, an, is a great opportunity to bring people together, for example, to network. We also have Welsh Clinical Leadership Fellows Days here down in Cardiff, which allows us to mix with our own peers. And there's also the Link Cymru, which is the Leadership Improvement Network within Wales, which helps with quality improvement across the nation. We are going to be looking at risk assessing women. We are going to be looking at rapid intervention in women who are bleeding ex excessively and looking at standardised care with point of care testing to actually direct the, the treatment that these women have and we're hoping that we're going to be able to replicate the excellent results from the research work so that all Wales can benefit from a, a lower morbidity associated with postpartum haemorrhage. So the project is expected to run for another two to three years during which we intend to make uh, a number of changes and measure those against the measurements that we've already looked at making and see how we've improved the care of women across Wales. It's always, um, it's always a really positive experience to get together to discuss new up and coming research and to look at a situation when clinicians just very much like yourself have been able to affect change in a, a day-to-day -day clinical setting. This work here today is building on a long uh, history with the thousand lives of understanding that reliable care is extremely important so being able to measure what we do and show that we're actually doing what we think we can do. Um, building in teamwork so it's not about the individual but about um, how we do this together in a systems view but certainly it's a global issue and it's, it's great to have all players in the field working together to learn from one another. So the Ops Cymru project is a huge opportunity for maternity services in Wales as a multidisciplinary project which is enabling quality improvement across 
all maternity areas, not just consultant-led delivery suites, but in the community and in the midwifery setting.